Uh, yeah? I'd call you. <laughs> I'd call my wife for sure. If I didn't answer? Yeah. That's a good bet, I'd say. It is. Did you? <laughs> All right, bye. Okay, bye. Love you. When you hang up before telling your wife love you back. Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday. I'm gonna go run a few errands. It is cold out, seven degrees outside, and both the girls are at school right now. I did not mix that enough. I just got such a big mouthful of white mocha syrup. Oh my gosh, okay. Mix that up. I need to get going because I kind of have a lot of stuff I wanna do, but I'm gonna return this lamp that I showed in my last video because it came damaged and they are sending me a new one because um, I can't find them in stock in any targets. I'm still gonna look, but it says out of stock everywhere. And then I'm also returning this shirt for Disney next month, which again, I showed you in my last video. And I think the girls' new sizes will be here today or tomorrow, I don't remember. Uh, we are all out of toilet paper in our house. We're not out of toilet paper. I wouldn't leave Shane here working today without toilet paper, but we're on the last little bit. So I need to go to Costco toilet paper because I feel like that is like the best deal. I just made the mistake of not putting on my coat to pump gas. It is miserably cold outside. So not enjoyable at all. So we're gonna put this back on to go get my pump out of my car, but it's so cold. I'm so ready for spring and we have so much winter to go. It snowed every day for the last like four-ish days here. We got a lot of snow. I think we're officially done with it for a little bit. I don't think there's any in the forecast, which I'm thankful for. I don't hate the snow. I would choose snow over this weather. Like luckily it was snowing a bunch, but it wasn't miserably cold out. Well, now it's miserably cold out. <laughs> I would take the snow. I need to go grab the girls from school in like five minutes. So I will just show you the stuff I got at Costco when I get home. Show you what I got from Target and Marshalls before I go get the girls. Kind of random stuff. This Cherry Cola Olipop. I've been wanting to try this one for a while. I really like the Strawberry Olipop and then the Dr. Good something. Dr. I don't know. It's supposed to taste like Dr. Pepper. That one's really good. The root beer is absolutely horrendous to me. Like the aftertaste is so bad on the root beer one but I'm excited to try the cherry cola version. This is the most random haul. I don't even know why I'm showing you these, but I also got the girls a big pack of dry erase markers. They love drawing on the easel that Lucy got for Christmas and Stella keeps leaving the caps off of the dry erase markers. So we're working on that, but we needed more of those. And then I also got them a magnetic eraser that will just like stick up there. They just keep pulling my kitchen towels out of the drawer and wiping off chalk and marker with them and I'd rather they didn't. So I grabbed that. Also got Stella these shoes. She already has these shoes in an eight and they just look so cute on her and fit her little skinny feet really, really well. And I saw they had a nine. I wanted to grab another pair because the eight still fits her right now, but she'll probably grow out of them soon. And they're only $9.99. I'm like slouched down so awkwardly. It's hurting my back. And then I grabbed this pack of slime for Lucy's class to go on her Valentine's. I did not get one for Stella's class. I don't know about giving a bunch of preschoolers slime, but I feel like first graders are fine. So I grabbed those for her to put on her Valentine's. I was not lying when I said that was a super random haul. And Olipop, some shoes, dry erase marker, slime, you know, whatever. All right, I have two more minutes. So we're gonna do this fast. I grabbed this bag for my little sister. She is the one coming to Disney World with us. So I got that for her for her birthday. And then I also got these packing cubes. I just thought she would think they're nice. And um, I thought it'd be helpful for her to pack to Disney World. So it's a three pack. It looks really nice actually for 10 bucks. And then I also got the girls a pack to go with their Disney stuff. I have one set of packing cubes, but I just decided I wanted more. So I also got this big pack for me because um, they just make life so much easier. And this one was $14.99. So I got this for me, this for the girl stuff for Disney. And then this is going to be Bailey's birthday present along with oops, these little travel squeeze bottles and this gel eye mask. I know she likes to wear eye masks to bed every night and this one you can like put in the freezer or warm up. So I got her that. I got myself a new brush. I've been using the girls hair brushes for years. Just they're like 
Disney wet brushes and I decided to splurge for five dollars and get myself my own so I have my own brush now that's good I do not need a new notebook but I got a new notebook because I'm a sucker and it's springy and cute it's a little bit later now and I was just hanging out with the girls after they got home from school and I thought I would show you some things that I got from Costco Again, nothing exciting. I got a big giant bag of these. The girls are obsessed with pretzels right now. Um, and they love these. So I got another big bag. They will eat all of them. <laughs> my lighting's being weird, but I got a six pack of Scrub Daddies. I am on my last one right now. And this is the best deal I've seen. I think it's like 12 bucks for six of these. So we needed a restock. What, baby? What? <gasps> you want what? I want <laughs> We're going down. You want something? Yeah. What do you want? Are you hungry? <laughs> <laughs> Another thing I buy every time is just these pouches. The girls love pouches sometimes, so I always have those stocked up and I'm running low right now. I have this basket. You want veggie straws. Okay, so I needed to restock my basket. This is from, um, home goods by the way this basket and then I also have a basket for like granola bars and things like that and then this is the reason that I went to Costco I got the big giant TP for refrigerated stuff I got a big giant spinach I'm on a cooked spinach kick right now so I just cook it in a pan for like a minute or two and then I put apple cider vinegar in there and like a tiny bit of salt it's it's so good. Don't knock it till you rock it. And then I got two packages of these egg bites. I put one in the freezer. I got these last time and both the girls and me loved them a lot. I just set you in my fridge to show you these things. These roasted chicken and Swiss um, roll ups. I got our tried and true favorite dinner, the chicken street tacos. I go crazy for those, they're so good. I genuinely crave them sometimes, like they're so delightful. And then I got a meatloaf and mashed potatoes. I think I'm actually gonna make this for dinner tonight though and save the tacos for tomorrow. Two things I got, I got another box of these egg bites. And then I got these Red's Organic Chicken Cilantro Lime Burritos. I lied, I have not tried these before, but they sounded really good. So I grabbed those and then I got another package of our favorite chicken to throw in the air fryer. I think that's everything I got. I didn't get any fruit there this time, which I usually stock up on fruit there, but the selection didn't look so hot today and it was expensive. So I wasn't gonna pay a lot of money for like mediocre produce. So I will get some more of that later in the week, but that's my Costco haul. I love these. You love that? Yeah. Ooh, that's a win. Stella likes the wrap. This is her second one. That's fine. Thank you. What, baby? What? Um, I am making a bracelet for Bailey's birthday, and then she's also going to make her one. Do you want to make her one? Yeah. Okay. You going to sit up here? Yeah. Okay. I need some. We are sitting here making some jewelry. I don't know for where my hair comes from. And my hair looks crazy. Yeah, for Bailey. It's 520 right now, which actually I'm so excited that it's not fully dark out yet. That means we're making progress here. They're so tiny. Shane is still working up in his office at that meatloaf in the oven soon. It's just easy. Then I don't have to deal with anything else. I'm gonna go work out. Hopefully Shane will be done by the time I'm done with this stuff. And then I'll just eat when I get home. But I have motivation now and I want to take advantage of that. I don't know that I will have motivation in a couple hours. We've got a little bit of a bead mess going over here. Lucy's making a bracelet. My camera is just not wanting to focus right now, but I made Bailey um, this bracelet with her name on it. <laughs> Hi, Steli. And just a little matching white one. I think she will like these. I know that she really likes blue. Now I'm gonna put her gift together for her and I think I might run it over there. Before I go to the gym. Love you. Love you. I don't have a separate box or bag or anything to put these in, so there we go. <laughs> these little squeezies and her eye mask and her packing cube, and I need to go get her shampoo. What, baby? I got her this Verb purple shampoo. I've been loving the regular conditioner of there, and this one had good reviews. She recently got her hair colored, so I thought that would be good for her to keep her blonde 
blonde because we tend to pull orange. And I don't think I have any tissue paper right now, but it's family and it's four days late. So it's okay. Still don't know where my hair clip went. They just disappear on me all the time. Um, but I'm wearing Stella's right now. My hair doesn't quite fit in it. Not the best attempt. What is going on here? But I'm gonna put in this meatloaf and the directions are confusing because it sounds like you can put this thing in the oven. I don't know how we ate it last time because Shane did this last time we had the meatloaf, but I don't like cooking things in plastic like ever. So I don't feel great about that even if I can put it in the oven, so I'm not going to. I'm gonna separate it into these smaller glass things. Um, okay, oh yeah, I got two. And my sister is leaving to go to a basketball game with my dad. So I'll just take her present over to her tomorrow. It's already late, so <laughs> who cares? What's well, one more day? Woo! Homemade meatloaf. What? What color do I like? Um, I'll do blue. How about that? Okay. <laughs> Orange and pink. Can I have them both? Okay, pink. Yep. Now this one is going to be a little harder. Boom! I'm gonna stick these in the oven. I don't even wanna point out my outfit because it's out of stock all over on Target. I don't think any of the sets are in stock. I got these on sale. Cute collared sweater with these knit pants. They're flared and I've been wearing them with my high top platform Converse and I love it. I wish I had it in 10 different colors because I'd wear it every day. I can't link it for you because it's out of stock and I hate doing that to you guys. What is going on? This thing just does not want to focus. My last like two videos, half of my clips last week I feel like we're like a little tiny bit out of focus and it was driving me nuts. I don't know what is going on there. You want to help me? Yeah. Can you do me a favor? Yeah. Okay, can you go take this to my bathroom? Please? I don't want to help. Please. I don't, help. I, I don't really care if you don't want to help. I'm asking you to help. No. No, that's him. No, that's him. Stella, take these to the bathroom, please. Ooh, good throw. Woo! <laughs> See, you gotta come forward, Stelly, so that I can throw it to you and not lose them. There you go, right there. Are you lucky? <laughs> I think you might be lucky. <laughs> oh, yeah. Woo! Oh, Daddy almost missed one. Check the board. Hey, Check the board. Mommy, I did Daddy not have that many. No, Daddy did. No. Mommy, How do you Daddy. feel? Accomplished. I'm sore. Daddy. My gut you is hurt. <laughs> you catch it with your hands, not let it get your Me gut. Too. Uh, <laughs> not mommy because she's yours. My hair did a number on it. It was a backwards hat. That's why you won. <laughs> I need a trade. Hey, Daddy. I just want to let you know that these are the comfiest shoes I've ever worn in my life. They're the Hoka Clifton 8s. Incredible. I'm putting in my contacts, and when I put them in this late in the day, I use the AccuView Oasis with Hydrolux. I love these. Um, when I put my daily contacts in this late in the day, I just save them in a case, and then I wear them the next day. I don't know if I'm supposed to do that, but... That's what I do. So I'm gonna go work out now and I'm wearing Shane's camo sweatshirt. This is very much so not my vibe, but it's like the comfiest crew neck. I love wearing this. It is so very cold out. I can't believe that I am motivated to go work out right now, 
but I am. Just do more there. I mean, I have a spin bike and a treadmill and like some random free weights that I can do here. I've been doing it at home for the last, I think like five days because of the weather, but I'm so ready to get in the gym and like just use some equipment and go do some things. 6.50 right now and I forgot that I grabbed a bubbler to a Target. I used to drink these a lot. They are so good, but I'm trying to get away from like all the um, fake sugary things. I am so close to Shane's truck. <laughs> Oh, like so close. I haven't had one of these in a while and I forgot how good they are. This one's my favorite, the blood orange mango. So good. I only bought a single because if I bought a four pack, I would drink them the next four days. I know me. It's the next day. I went to the gym last night and then I didn't vlog anymore. I came home and showered. I went the heck to sleep. So I am just starting this video up today. I figured I would vlog today too, post it tomorrow. And that is the plan. I have been looking for that coat. Shane must have put that up there. I've been looking for that fuzzy jacket I have. I was so confused. It's right there, but it's so cold today. I will not be wearing it. I need my full on winter coat. It's negative four at the moment very chilly day. Stella and I are going to go find her a puzzle. Hopefully a Peppa Pig puzzle. She has earned a new puzzle and she's obsessed with them right now and she's really really good at them. We're gonna run to Dollar Tree first. If they don't we'll try Walmart but we have about an hour and a half before we need to be at the girls school because Lucy has just like a little short field trip that we are going to drive her and her friends over to. We found a Peppa Pig puzzle, an LOL doll puzzle, and Gabby's dollhouse, huh? Perfect. It is so cold out. Let's go, let's go. Oh my God, it's so cold. I am so glad that Dollar Tree had the puzzle that Stella wanted so we didn't have to go to Walmart. Also found this claw clip there and I had this exact claw clip from Amazon, I think, and I sat on it and broke it, so I'm excited to have another one of these. Good job. Mommy, do mommy pig. You do mommy pig? Yeah. Good idea. For you. Go. Your turn. I push it in four o'clock and originally I was just gonna drop Lucy and her friends off at the field trip and then come home and then go pick them back up but on the way over there Stella said she wanted to go and the preschool was going too she obviously just doesn't go today the preschool was going on the field trip so we just decided to go with them and it was actually really fun there's just like volleyball court basketball court gymnastics things a bounce house stuff like that shooting on the basketball hoops for a while I haven't done that in forever I'm a little sore now, but it was really fun. And when I was done, I text Shane and I was like, we have to get a basketball hoop in our driveway. I wanna be shooting regularly because it was fun. I'm not gonna act like I'm good at basketball, by the way. Ask anyone in my personal life, I am not talented in basketball. It's just fun to shoot, but I hated playing it. Love watching it, love shooting, hated playing the sport zero stars. So all that being said, it was a fun afternoon and I think we were there for two-ish hours and then I got to bring Lucy home with me so I got her home a little early today. But while I had the chance to sit down for a minute, I did just want to mention a fundraiser um, and I'm going to link it down below. I'm going to link the GoFundMe but one of my oldest friends, we've been friends for like 17 or 18 years, <laughs> a very long time, um, her mother-in-law has had cancer a couple different times and this time around her chemo was not working and they took her off of her treatments. I don't want to go into too much detail. I want to respect their privacy. I will, like I said, link the GoFundMe down below and that'll give you like a little bit more information. But her mother-in-law is still needing to go to work every day or as much as possible, even though she's not feeling well and she should be spending the rest of her time resting, spending time with family. I just do not think that it's a burden that she should have to have. Link will be in my description, and if you are at all inclined, I would really appreciate it if you would go donate five, 10, whatever you have to give um, to her GoFundMe to help with medical bills and groceries. I just can only imagine how stressed they are right now on top of everything going on medically with needing to pay her bills and going to work still. So. Um, I would really appreciate that. And if you don't wanna go the GoFundMe route, 
I will link my Venmo down below for like a couple days. I'm only gonna do this like two days from when I post this video because I wanna get her money as soon as possible. But um, I will also link my Venmo if you wanna send any money that way. I understand times are tough right now, so if you cannot spare any money, I completely get it. I am collecting money from Venmo and then Shane and I are gonna match whatever I get in my Venmo. However much that adds up to, we are going to double it. Really appreciate you guys so much. You're always so supportive of me and helpful. And I would love to be able to use my platform to help someone out that needs it. So the links will be down below. I think I'm just gonna end this video here. I have a couple things I need to get done around the house. Thank you so much for watching and always supporting my channel. I appreciate you so much. And I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.